there's a possibility that she can be in shape even before, the, before she's out of the house. I don't know about you, but my hat goes off to the man who is okay with his crush going after somebody else. Like, why would he say that? Well, I go by the name of Chewy Chu, and right here on Bella Niger, we're about to talk to the second evicted housemate to find out why he said that and more. Enjoy. I'm Chewy. I'm Saif. I mean, we know Saif. I mean, just in case. Uh, just in case. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, you look very nice. Thank you very much. You look yeah. too. No cap. Yeah, no um, cap. Just, uh, I like that stuff. I'm just going <laughs> to freeze out the crown. Oh, wow. Okay. Yes, that's. this is usually my thing, but oh, that this, makes this was inspired by you. Oh, wow. Yeah, it was. Thank you. You Thank feel you. honored? I appreciate it. It really was. Yes. Nice. So, dude, what the hell is a tech bro doing in the Big Brother house? Well, that was the same question that pushed me to the house too, right? I mean, I balance have, this algorithm. Yes, I have watched like um, a lot of seasons of Big Brother, and I just hear a lot of models and a lot of um, influencers and a lot of other other people, right? Yeah. And then next thing, there's no there's no coder, there's no designer, there's no <laughs> pretty shop. Yeah, it was vexed. Exactly. So, in as much as I had my own personal reasons, right, about like okay, at least bad as is bad, it can be seen one tech designer person to represent the design community for that. Did you hack into the system to get him? Oh, no, 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 no. But I you could have? And I, I, I can't confirm and deny that. So that's that. What was your personal reason? Uh, my personal reason, I had like goals since like four years ago. I've been pitching to a lot of people and they have been doing me see finish and you know, I was like, at first, I was more like, I told God this year, I just want something, even an international job that we get it in dollars. Mm -hmm. right? make i save the money by myself right let me save the money by myself and then like use it to create capital to do whatever i want to do and then the audition came out like the, the audition came out and then i'm like uh i have friends that are telling me guy come on just shoot this thing i don't know why just go big brother like at first i was like when the people won't go big brother i already choose them for me mm. okay, that was my mentality was, then when i went home I'm like what do i have to lose like it's two things they know reply me and i move on with my life for example or they reply me and then i'll be like oh my god things can happen and last last oh my god things can happen things happen exactly so uh, here i am all right now you 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 say you are a full stack visual communicator yes what does it mean to those who aren't in tech I'm, okay. a, I'm a tech bra okay not bro but bra okay. bra yeah because i'm, I'm yeah. in between okay what does that mean Okay. Break it down like the simplest terms. So visual communication practically revolves around images, shapes, letters, colors, literally things that you can see. Mm. Right. So where I say I'm a bit in full stack visual communicator starts from user experience design, going all the way to creative design, going all the way to 2D animation, going all the way to motion graphics, right? Exactly. So those are the I call them the front end of any brand. Let's put that way. Right, so the back end is the marketing or the app itself, all right, the, but what you see with your eye is the design. That's what they call front end. Exactly, that's what I call the front end. You mm. get. So but when I said, why I still call myself a full stack visual is that I also know things in the back end. I know how marketing works. I know how brand strategy works. I know how brand communication works. I do that too, right? Mm. Exactly. But at the same time, I also design. So it's like, I understand the perspective you're coming from. I can get what you want and I can design it for you at the same time. Ah, so that's so like you're like a very versatile guy. Yes. Full stack. So now you're on the front. This, 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 I, want, I hope this is going to be a full stack interview. So oh, yeah, definitely. You're, you're the front end of the camera. Take us to the back end of Big Brother. What happened in the house? How was the experience for you? Yeah, the experience. What didn't we see? And what didn't we know? Give us the full oh. stack. <laughs> okay, first things first. My experience in the house was amazing, mm. right? And um, in as much as I was shocked by the differences, the level one, level two situation, I was intrigued. Uh -huh. You get, I'm all about new experiences. Yeah. If I'm being honest, you get. Before I even enter the house, I already like told myself, "I'm going to navigate the whole situation based on." The, you don't get plan. You I don't get one or, two, one or two things. You get, but when I entered the house and I saw. As a Sunday, when I knew that people are entering the house, but now they're not entering here. Mm. That's when I knew that almost. Oh, you knew? Up. Like, I could, like, I, like, by once, okay, that this guy, Khaled, he has this time when he prays. 
So it's like that he has this time in his head that I sometimes use to give myself a perception of what time is in the house. Mm. And I'm like, okay, this guy is not deep. This one is the last prayer. Now night, people never fall in. Mm. And this is not Sunday. That means these people are somewhere. Mm. And then that's when I started getting intrigued. And then before you know, I found that I was a level one and level two. Now I was shocked, but I was intrigued. Trenches and Island. Just when I came out, I found that it was trenches and Islanders. Uh, when I was inside the house, I was like level one, level two. That was what I was thinking. When uh-huh. I came out and saw trenches, I said, try it, see finish. Because in this small <laughs> house, you get. And those ones are level one, um, Islanders, see their, see their mansion. Like Maka said, it's a mansion. Mm. Okay. So, now, um, the experience was awesome, yeah. right? Yeah. Um, I loved the competition between both levels, right? Okay. I I was intrigued by the fact that whoever wins hit to hit will have to eliminate the other person. That's why I put in all my efforts in the hit to hit and the tax, right? And that's why, in as much as I tried and I couldn't, but I made sure that at least I passed that first stage to get that second stage and find a way to make it work. Exactly. Now, um, I know that um, level two is more like um, with chaos as order. Right, so it's more like uh, everybody have different energies, right? People are really outspoken and very expressive. Some too expressive, mm. you get. And sometimes the expression comes at the right wrong time, at the wrong time. You get. Sometimes it comes when the tax is going on. Mm. But regardless of the situation, like everybody puts in their that extra effort, right, to want to make things work. Right. So that's what I love about level two. Now, at the same time, I wouldn't lie. I love peace of mind. Maybe it's because of in the creative space and you just like to be listen to your head yeah you get that kind of thing. so sometimes when the whole thing is going i just find a way to tell people that please open gardens let me mm. next or i would just go to the, to the room or sometimes i just lie on the couch and just cover myself with duvet and just leave that space in my head mm. exactly and now uh, that's for level two um, level one i saw them as people that were quite competitive right at the same time i was like i, I did one weird um a breakdown i was like they have more flex and more what's it called it's physical people right we had more normal people you get let me use that word normal people exactly uh, but then when it came to the intellect here i think we had more creative side more deep let me use that word deep creative mm. sides than them mm. right and uh, they i i think they know that mm. you get that's why they put in their extra efforts too Mm. You get exactly. If not, I mean, if for those they look or do or see finish and just like, uh, I'm like no stress yourself, you need them to know <laughs> that kind of thing. Yeah. And uh, what again? What again? Um, yeah, I, I, the whole, um, the sorry, the pool party, the wager that yeah. you have to win for you to get the pool party and the after um, after night party and stuff like that. I was like, that was also cool. I love that. Right, and uh, in a way, I also dig the whole fact of um, it's only once or twice or three times in a week that you can meet the other level one people. You get so any conversation you want to have with your friend, you already have like five to ten minutes, if not, or if sometimes less than, if not, not to wait to Saturday. Mm. It's kind of give this kind of um, suspense to it, mm. which was also really nice. So, yeah, you know, it was an actual experience. I really like if I'm to enter there again, I enter there again. So, in all this breakdown and analysis you speak about expressions and chaos and it seems there was chaos in your heart some romantic chaos in your heart <laughs> and uh you were expressing that to um well someone else. uh i wouldn't say mine was more like chaos break it down okay so <coughs> romantic chaos yeah i won't call it i won't call mine romantic chaos what would you call it I why well, would say it's chaos because um you know chaos is, means like I'm asking myself should I should I not should I no should I chaos not? is you know depends on how we mm, you know. but the chaos is um or certainty Think, oh you yes, are you're I was that my I was very I was just like ah gosh okay she looks nice um she looks down to earth she's straightforward right she's goofy right mm-hmm. move but as it bad nah yes or no so she didn't tell you are you, you ready him, nah, last, are, you, last. are you ready for now, see the thing, right? I am ready when she's out of the house. Mm. Now, because I, like I said, two things. I've been in this compact space before, mm. right? And I know that sometimes in an enclosed space for a long time, feelings tend to fall out. So when was the, was it boarding house or NYC camp or yeah, were you in prison? I, I went to Madonna University, so. Okay. And then there is NYC camp and then there is boarding school. You know how so all of those places you were finding big? No, 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 no. All of those places I was watching. You are watching? Yeah. So I'm more of like an observer uh-huh. and I read body languages. Mm-hmm. Exactly. So it's more like, uh, sometimes there was this time in my life when I used to just have like a 20 leaf book. I'd always write the names of men or the names of guys, the names of girls. 
the ones that are trying to link up then i'll be like future predictions of the one we know we're living last two days i think big brother needs if they need extra writers in the backroom staff they should they should come up reach out to you <laughs> i don't know i don't know i give big brother my own predictions too for ships and what about your prediction so yeah my own prediction is actually my own prediction is that simple right there's a possibility that she can be in ship even before the before she's out of the house that's a possibility right but so now, you're open to the fact that she's not going to she's going to forget about you yes it's life i'm man. a realist man i'm a realist right man. so now that's the thing now doesn't still mean i don't have a soft spot for her doesn't still mean that i don't like her now if i'm Apparently, she doesn't have anything, and we meet outside, and we want to reconnect and continue from where we stop. That's fine and good. Mm. I'm up for that, right? Mm -hmm. If she is in the house and definitely maybe finds a ship and wants to move from there too, that's fine. I also love good friends. So she comes out and she just denies you. Like I'm not gonna say it happened last season, but uh, you know, you get. Will you fight for her? <laughs> I believe everybody has choices, right? And I believe that you cannot just wake up. And us be given choice. It's supposed to linger for her. Even before you chop breakfast, the person will serve you the breakfast. Don't think and wear before you say or he say, "Hey, we need to talk." Mm. Exactly. So, and that's why I don't believe in. Sometimes I don't believe in second chances when it comes to relationships. So like you thought about it, and then you not have the kind of you tell me. I mean, no one was like you for Kukuma does tell me okay, we need to talk. You don't like this. You don't like that. Let's settle it. <laughs> Instead, you are like we need to talk. I can't continue this. It was a choice. Okay. Exactly. Okay. Mm -hmm. So um, you've been in the house. You're out now. What's next for you? Well, um, back to those goals that I had in mind, right? So I know that uh, I, 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 first of all, I've told myself that I have worked for a creative agency, an advertising agency, a media ah. agency. I want to manage or own an agency. Exactly. I want to be the one to. I mean, like I've seen their ideas, right? Their ideas are really, really good, right? At the same time, I've seen international ideas that are also really good and i want to be someone that can merge both sides i think we should talk after this definitely, yeah. definitely. I, I also i play in that space as okay. well, so that'd be that'd exactly be so we'll i i want to either manage or own why i say manage means i can actually work with a company right that i can now have a team of designers that we can make things work mm. or i own that creative agency and have a team of both designers marketing staff advertising staff and whatever content mm. people and everything and we make it work mm. so that's one now um i want to double in the fashion line urban street fashion i have a name on your weird right on your weird is the fashion so basically i feel like um everybody has a touch of weird in them Right, that um, sometimes not, not me, but as well as it may be, not me, yeah, that's the thing. You think, no, you think. not me, <laughs> just not me. Okay, fine, fine, that yeah, works. That thank works. you, that works. So, everybody has like a touch of weird in them, everybody but me, oh, but you, thank everybody you. but you. I, I see what you're trying to do there, don't sneak <laughs> me in there. No, sure, 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 cool, yeah, everybody but you mm -hmm. has a touch of weird, right? Mm -hmm. So, I'm more like, yeah, um, embody that weird and mm -hmm. yet still look good at it, okay, exactly. So, that's the urban street fashion side of it. Then um, I have the tech space where I want to like have a product on real estate revolving around shortlist, shortlets, and then uh, I don't have product revolving around NFTs, right? And then lastly, um, with time, I feel, I, I'm leaving that one as the final. I'm leaving that one as the final final because I know it's going to have like a lot of efforts, a lot of big things to make it work. So, but then that would be to have or to manage a channel on. It's multi choice or like on DST. Man, man, yeah. shooting your yeah. shots, shooting your sure. shots. I mean, with time, I would love to ask you so much more questions, but I know you have to run. Uh, yeah. Right? But guys, you can check out. We have a fun 10 question segment okay. with this man on Bella Niger's social media pages. You can check that out as well. Follow him across his social media platforms. It is listed on the screen right now. Yeah. Follow me on mine, follow Bella Niger also across all their social media platforms. Thank you, Sai, for Thank everything. Thank you very much. Um, appreciate you. I really appreciate Right? Chop Knuckle. Oh yeah, I have a gift for you. Oh wow! Um, as you become more successful, yeah, have a Johnny Walker to toast to your many successes. We keep walking, rooting for you. Yeah, this is not the end of the road, Definitely right? You may have been out of the house, but yeah. the journey still continues. So Definitely. keep walking, my guy. Keep walking. All right, thank, thank you. Thank you. Very you. Much. Chop knuckle. Boom. <laughs>